Someone searching for the next oh. big thing in technology. For the next big thing. Okay. Nice music choice for the start. The main thing is not to get too excited <laughs> and buy stuff blindly. The man on the stage calls it a Rika moment of the generation. You need to try very hard to impress me. <laughs> Innovation is empowering. As Innovation. technology advances, its impact on our lives continues to expand and create lots new of ways. very We're strong so words they use. To share but can the they impress us can this year? You. you need to try hard to meet our expectations. First of all, seven years of security updates and also seven years of OS updates on all S24 series phones, starting from Base, S24, and of course S24 Ultra. Seven years of security updates and seven generations of OS upgrades. Okay. With Galaxy S24 series. Nice. Galaxy is truly phone of the future. Mm. <laughs> we will see it. Second, live two-way translation. In this feature, you can use live translation on the phone calls. For example, you can speak your native language and the person on the other side of the line will hear his native language and vice versa. So you both can understand each other for example, you have contacts that speak different languages and your phone will remember which contact uh, use what language and they will automatically translate your calls and translate your messages for them. Okay, because you don't mm, speak they, their language. They are talking about live translation of We're multiple languages. I travel a lot a and By sometimes it's real really pain. Not uh, every country can understand your English. But we already have some live translations. The Galaxy S24 series can provide live translations of your call, both verbally and on screen, right away. Live translation of calls and text messages. Oh, that's interesting. This is really interesting. I am intrigued because. I work with lots of foreign languages. My all, all of people that I work with uh, talk different languages. Sometimes it's, it's very hard for them to speak uh, English. It's hard <laughs> even for me to speak English. But if this feature will be really clean, I think it will be a nice game changer for me, for my work. I like it. I really like it. But will it deliver? This is the question. I think we will know this this month. So lots of translation. I love it. It will help me a lot if they implement lots of languages from the start. For now only 13 languages. So you can text messages in foreign language and your chat member will see it in his own language. So, as I understand correctly, live calls, likes live text messages. I like it, I enjoy it. Third feature, chat assist. This is the same AI translation feature. So, uh, your phone will help you in your in your messenger's chats, it will automatically translate messages from your friends, from your contacts, and translate your messages for them. Also, neat feature. I speak a lot with not native English speaking clients, so I can easily talk with them now. I miss this feature a lot. Fourth feature, they call it Gemini AI. It is the code name for this whole Galaxy AI thing. Uh, it will use the 
Neira processor inside the phone to communicate with different apps inside the phone. This made with uh, collaboration with Google directly. They talked about lots of collaboration uh, <laughs> on stage during this event. Uh, interesting to see what will they bring with all these features when we finally get our phones in the hands. This uh, new NPU unit inside the phone and Gemini Eye will help uh, <laughs> a little gimmick feature, but uh, get stickers directly from photos and send them in your messenger chats. And this will help to add some flavor to your messages, to your text. It can add a professional tone, it can add more friendly tone, so it will take the text from your message and transform it into different styles of, of language, of speaking, for example. More professional, more friendly, more emotional, maybe more poetic tone. Uh, we will see, we will try, we will test all of this. Very excited for this whole AI stuff, because uh, this, this eventually will go to our life. You want it, you don't, but it will get to all our devices, even to our refrigerators. So get used to it, deal with it. This is the future. Unfortunately or luckily, depending on what you think about all this AI stuff. Welcome to the future. Oh, it's cold here. Um, we are 30 minutes into this presentation, but for now we just all AI, innovation, AI, innovation. All right. I like this first step. The implementation of real robotic AI that understand context is very important for me. I miss these features on this planet. <laughs> Seven new implementation of Android Auto. Uh, for those who drive car, this is, will be very handy because your phone can now recap and sum up your text and audio messages and give you small compact recap of everything in this message so you so you won't be distracted from the road in your inside your car very nice feature i use car a lot i can't uh, work i can't live without a car and every day i have to take my phone with one hand and try to operate it try to send messages or try to read messages sometimes uh, i need more clever more clever advanced assistant in my phone we will see we will try to test this so this is like auto chat gpt for summary android auto will also suggest they can sum up your you messages for example you are driving the car and so uh, you can ask uh, the ai robot to sum up no what he, what your friend is talking about to a destination you just received via text i like it it's like today. understanding or even context quick reply. eight new feature this is recap of your call meetings recap of lectures uh, this ai feature can detect a speech of different speakers and sort it that way also it can uh, highlight keynotes so you have compressed and recap version of the meeting of the lecture very handy can be helpful to recap of lectures and meetings with transcript here. assistance <laughs> a robot will recap your meetings speech to text in different languages and uh, summarization and will automatically sum up everything that was said in this speech nice nine feature advanced voice recording on the phone recorder it can detect your voice it can detect voice of different people and also make a recap summarization of what you said small but we can add it to the bucket of today <laughs> ai bucket of innovations tense feature is uh, note assist it can help in real time uh, to sort and manage your notes 
For example, if you have some large text, clunky uh, text, uh, you can hit, you can click the recap button and it will organize everything. It will sort out, it will make uh, division and um, place your text in the logical orders and even group some text in a single unit, for example, the place you mention, the time you mention, the uh, different persons that you mention in this text. Very nice feature, for example, if you want to send some useful information to your colleagues, to your friends about upcoming meeting, about some event. Very nice. Also nice feature to correct your handwritings, uh, to make it more pleasant, to give it more pleasant and more polished look. Mm, note assist. Some notes from a team project. Interesting. I can tidy things up by adding a bit of structure, like headings and... He says that <laughs> everything that to they are showing today is just a beginning. As you've never seen we will see. They promised seven years of OS updates. I think you guessed what phone I will buy this year. <laughs> The future. 11th feature, Google Cloud. Mm, very controversial, but for those who need cloud, here it is. Google provides mm, cloud features because on this event, Samsung tells us that they have collaboration with Google. They implement all new fancy features inside their phones. So they will implement nice uh, features with Google only into the Samsung phones interesting to see i'm excited to announce that google cloud and our gemini <laughs> models are google cloud new generative ai functionality on i don't like clouds to deliver helpful ai experiences the only cloud that i like is inside my closet <laughs> and there's one other really exciting my own server that i am established Since the of Android, with my own hands i don't trust corporations security cloud uh, I don't like this. <laughs> Remember, cloud is just another man's computer. 12. Uh, this is new advanced AI search. They call it circle to search. So they implement new gesture inside the Android devices. So it will be in all Galaxy S24 series in basic, in S24 plus in S24 Ultra, so you just make simple gesture of a circle. Uh, you can mm, highlight, for example, some part of YouTube video, of Instagram post. You can search for some parts of the image or, or the, of the video. Everything on your screen can be a subject to circle gesture and it will uh, try to search and give you some results. It should be also AI powered and give you more context, more complex uh, information, because now they claim that you can ask more complex questions in this uh, particular part. I'm very excited for this because I think that we have lots of assistants today, Bixby, Siri, uh, Google Assistant, but they are very clunky and I hope that this feature will be a next logical step in this AI assistant in our phones. It can give you products you can buy, touristic roads, restaurants that uh, was inside text message, for example. You can just take uh, text message from your friend, highlight it with circle, and it will give uh, information about the places he mentioned, about things that he mentioned, maybe products that he suggests to you. You can just highlight it with the circle. Phone will give you some results. And once again, it can be used inside any app on your screen. So this feature is just a gesture implemented inside one UI of the Samsung. So you can highlight any text, any video, any picture in any application on the screen. I want to try this feature. To bring the latest innovations this feature will be to this feature circle to search will be available on we all Samsung devices on our S24 series. Samsung. 
as we enter this next era of certain more security and total control of your data inside your phone so you can control what feature you want to protect also they advertised knox uh, security inside the phone so this is it if you are care about security this is the part to look into it maybe it will suit you well also In they addition, are the security saying and that they are giving total control for our privacy we can choose what will be transferred to camera, google services what's not hard to believe but security but goes we'll beyond see. just our smartphones 14 pro visual engine it will fuel the power of the device so galaxy phones will have more gpu and npu power and this new pro engine with driver will help with communication with camera with ai features inside the phone they removed the reflection AI by just pressing the button of what you can create exponentially and 15 feature galaxy phones will have ai powered cameras also they advertised 60 percent larger pixels uh, we will see how will this affect low light performance there was very little talk about new glass new sensors and if we see it has 10 megapixels 3x optical zoom 200 megapixels uh, main camera 12 megapixels ultra wide and 50 megapixels 5x zoom thanks to the new oh, improved of cropping. NPU, the ai is faster and more so accurate new this NPU. it can perform multi-frame processing wow, multiple wow. frames <laughs> for your applause, they there's more ai quickly analyzes multiple images image from both in one. cameras even before you press the shutter and based on the 16 tape in zoom also telephoto lens got stabilization inside also they uh, talked about a ai spatial zoom where you can press to the object and it will automatically reframe and zoom to this uh, exact place on the screen everyone welcome the one and only mr beast what's mr. up everybody beast. I'm mr beast <laughs> i want to tell you about the new samsung galaxy s24 ultra while going 100 feet in the air Raise me up! 70 collaboration with Instagram, with some messenger applications. You can have HDR photos, HDR videos, and nighttime uh, photography inside Instagram natively. Uh, very interesting. I don't use Instagram at all, <laughs> but I guess lots of people do. This can be a very handy feature for you. You snap the they are partnered the with uh, social media In fact, programs the S24 and they are partnered the with Instagram. To have HDR enabled for photos on Instagram. And to introduce Grill Lots Armor of collaborations from, S24 Ultra. from Samsung. Thanks, Drew. Back to you. 18. Slow motion. Uh, AI slow motion for normal videos. For example, you shoot video in normal frames per second, 25, 30, 50, 60, and AI will automatically try to uh, insert fake frames between the normal frames and give you slow motion video. Do not know how will it appear because I love slow motion and uh, there was no talking about uh, real slow motion with real frames. I want 120 to 40 uh, frames per second, 480 frames per second, 1000, 2000 frame per, frames per second. S camera sensors are very small and with this nice modern sensors and processors we can have faster readout and easily get a very very slow footage for slow amount of time, for example for 1, 2, 3 second burst. There was no mentioning of real slow motion, only <laughs> AI for slow motion. Do not know how the image quality will be, but this is a feature they mentioned on this convection. So didn't record it slow motion. Era? 
Take Used on slow motion. I am very in interested. I love slow motion. Video required you to create each missing part frame by frame. Oh. But now with the Pro Visual slowing engine, down already missing. Slowing down slow already existing with a simple <laughs> video. long press. It will impressive, right? But okay. But now I want real slow That's motion. Galaxy AI at work. 19 is quick share between all Android devices. They have opened uh, this quick share feature uh, on every Android device. So if you want to quick share something, uh, you can you, you can quick share to your friends with another Android devices more easily. Nice handy feature. I love it. I wish this quick share or, or airdrop <laughs> feature was between all the devices but uh, we get what we get quick share between all android so devices android users will be able to file share across more devices moving beyond galaxy phones they include have, uh, other android devices samsung has partnered and even with google to allow quick share on all Isn't android devices i wish they implement cross-platform between and Apple. Now, <laughs> to tell us about the incredible so, performance of the Galaxy S24 series. Sometimes I work with people DT. who have iPhones. It will be very handy. 20. Better battery life. This is what they advertised. How much each battery capacity will have, but there was no mentioning why battery will be better maybe because of better processor better optimization of software we will see because these modern phones still have all technology for batteries we need to test it before saying anything more 21 feature is uh, 2600 nits of uh, brightness of the screen they didn't mention is it a peak brightness is it sustained brightness but I believe this is a peak HDR brightness uh, in the direct sun rays. But uh, nice bump. It's impressive gameplay than New Pokemon. New screen, 2,600 nits. Hi, everyone. Wow, I cannot believe I'm here at Unpacked. I'm so used to talking to people from behind my camera. It is crazy to see this many people in person. 22, they advertised better in PUs and uh, GPUs increase and this will lead to more smooth experience in operating system, in video work, in playing games and speaking about games, 23rd feature is ray tracing in games. They even uh, invited Pokemon in the presentation <laughs> and we will get ray tracing games inside uh, our phones, Galaxy S24 phones. It is nice because today we have lots of uh, handheld devices, Steam Deck, some MCI have new portable device, Lenovo, Asus and whatnot. But uh, I don't understand why this exists because phones can already fulfill this feature. Maybe someone needs stickers, someone needs uh, joystick stickers, extra buttons but uh, some phones have nice attachments uh, that can give you everything that standard uh, gamepad, joystick. It's nice to see that corporations start to see it gaming. Some people love gaming, so here it is. More gaming power in your hands. Making the gaming oh, experience feel they are realer implementing ray tracing in the games. We're working with gaming studios, publishers and game engine companies to bring you many more experiences enhanced by ray tracing. Series they will, will use multiple performance cooling unique. solutions inside. They are talking and about liquid, vapor chamber, by Galaxy interesting. AI, so you can game for longer. 24, titanium, oh, titanium frame in S24 Ultra. I don't know how much titanium they will use. Maybe one gram, two gram. <laughs> Who knows? Um, but here it is. Not on the iPhone now get titanium, 
not on the Xiaomi have titanium. Now Samsung get to the titanium team. Galaxy oh, S24 titanium! Ultra, a super <laughs> How much titanium ability. you have? One it's gram. Samsung Galaxy's toughest metal yet. Twenty-five. Old S24 series. Samsung will now get flat screen for those uh, curve screen haters. Here it is. All screens are nice and flat. Uh, you can use S Pen without uh, problems. My congratulations for you who wanted a flat screen. 26. New collaboration now with a Gorilla. They have new Gorilla armor. They advertise more scratch resistant, more protection, more durability. But of course, we will see first hand uh, tests. Some people love to use uh, their smartphones without any screen protectors. Can't understand it. I always protect my phones. And uh, here it is. Gorilla Armor, brand new screen, brand new glass. 27. All S24 series, 24 base, 24 plus, will have unified aluminium design with flat screens. Hard to tell how they will compare to previous generation. Is it huge improvement? Are they even <laughs> different? But here it is. 28. Eco friendliness. This is, they spent huge amount of this presentation on how they use eco-friendly materials, recyclable materials, but uh, if you care, here it is. But in my opinion, if you want to be eco-friendly, just uh, give us easy possibility to replace our batteries, give us charging brick inside the boxes, give us some headphones inside the boxes, so we won't buy it separately and waste even more fuel on the logistics and transportations of all these paper boxes. So eco-friendliness, huge portion of this event was covering how they are eco-friendly. Let's go further. Talking about being eco-friendly. No okay. I'm going to. You. Corporations can pretend as much as they can. We found ways to help the environment too, such as more using more sustainable them, fabrics more power and upcycling textiles. They talk a bunch of stuff about being eco-friendly, how they use recyclable materials. And should do more for for those who are interested in it, Two years maybe ago, it's very important we to you. Here we go, here it is. I don't care, this is just big advertisement, so nothing Since to add to this. Let's go further. If you are so eco-friendly, maybe give charger, maybe add charger to your box, maybe add earphones to your, <laughs> to your packing, so we do not waste so much fuel of transportation from transportation companies. So, and expect how that about step that? Step <laughs> in more 29. Use Samsung Health AI. Uh, they want to implement new machine learning. They also talked about collaboration with some hospital, medical companies to implement uh, better and intuitive sleep control. They call it smart sleep analysis. Uh, they will give you score about your sleep quality and uh, lots of new health features that are powered with this new AI machine learning. I use smart watches from Samsung, but I never ever used it for tracking my health other than tracking my footsteps so I can uh, make myself in the evening to go <laughs> and run for a couple of uh, minutes. I don't use this feature. I do not trust these uh, technologies, but for those who use it extensively, I think that it is massive improvement and uh, machine learning will try to give you better algorithms, better scores and better understanding of what is going on with your health. So here it is. New year. They will track your sleep, your activity, tips your, your day healthier. physical your physical By choosing from a selection of predefined health goal trackers, 
and checking them throughout know. the day. Is it a good idea be better to for give whatever comes your, your way. health? Samsung health to give your health in the hands of a robot. To evolve with you, if this robot is not too advanced. Of your unique patterns. Galaxy Ring. This is new. <laughs> And 30 feature of uh, this whole event, the, the new device from Samsung, it's called Galaxy Ring. You put it on your ring and it will track your health status better. I think that is the whole purpose of this new device is to track your health because I do not suggest you to trust your health for smartwatches, rather do it for professional medical equipment. So there was nothing detailed about this new Galaxy Ring. I think that we will know it in a couple of months. So quick summarization and recap of this new event. A lot of AI features, almost uh, no mentioning of uh, hardware improvements inside of cameras, lenses, sensors, none of this. There was not much talking about new Snapdragon chip, almost none. There was, there was almost no talking about hardware improvements, so I do not have anything new for you. Just graphs with improvement in CPU, if NP, NPU and GPU, but what does it all mean? I think that we will get it in full reviews when these phones start to ship to real people design of the devices are almost or if not identical to the last years so it's hard to judge right now it looks like lots of cool new AI features but inside last year's body and hardware but who knows to tell more details I need to get it in my hands and make a review so I will make a separate video in depth what I think about all this convection I wish you a nice day.